Causes of male infertility can be broadly categorized into pre-testicular causes, testicular causes, and post-testicular causes. Testosterone is the principal hormone responsible for the regulation of sperm production. Testosterone secretion is regulated by the hypothalamic pituitary gonadal axis. GnRH hormone, released from the hypothalamus, stimulates the anterior pituitary gland to secrete FSH and LH hormones, which are the major gonadotropic hormones in human. Out of these two, LH hormone is the one which stimulates the testis to produce testosterone. When there is excess testosterone synthesis, the hormone itself acts on the hypothalamus to reduce LH secretion and thereby reducing excess testosterone production. This is called the negative feedback mechanism of androgen secretion. Pretesticular causes of male infertility are congenital or acquired diseases of the hypothalamus, pituitary, or peripheral organs that alter the function of hypothalamic pituitary gonadal axis. These diseases will manifest as reduced GnRH, FSH, or LH levels, or a combination of hormone deficiency. It is important to know that these disease conditions are very rare and account for only a minority of cases of male infertility. Some of these conditions include Kalman syndrome, which is characterized by delayed or absent puberty and an altered sense of smell. Prader-Willi syndrome, characterized by GnRH deficiency. Lawrence Moon Beetle Syndrome Pituitary tumors such as prolactinomas, where high prolactin levels produce the testosterone levels in affected individuals. These patients will also have galacteria and gynecomastia or abnormal breast development. Isolated LH deficiency is a condition characterized by low LH levels and normal FSH levels. These individuals will have large testis and low ejaculatory volumes. In isolated FSH deficiency, FSH level is normal, and they have low sperm counts. Individuals with thalassemia will also have infertility because they undergo multiple blood transfusions, which result in deposition of iron in the pituitary and testis. Ultimately, built-up iron will cause tissue damage and infertility. In Cushing syndrome, high cortisol levels in blood will exert a negative feedback effect on the hypothalamus, which causes reduced GnRH secretion. Other causes of excess cortisol include adrenal hyperplasia and tumors and exogenous steroid use. Excess estrogen will exert a negative feedback effect on the pituitary to reduce FSH and LH hormones, ultimately reducing testosterone levels. Conditions where there is estrogen excess include Sertoli cell tumors, Leydig cell tumors, liver failure, and severe obesity. Testicular causes of male infertility can be divided into chromosomal causes and non-chromosomal causes. Chromosomal causes include Kleinfelter syndrome, which is characterized by high FSH and LH levels and low testosterone levels. Other conditions include XX male and XYY male, Noonan syndrome, mixed gonadal dysgenesis, which leads to ambiguous genitalia, androgen receptor dysfunction, Y chromosome microdeletion syndrome, and Down syndrome. Non chromosomal testicular causes include varicocele, undescended testis, testicular trauma, Sertoli cell only syndrome, chemotherapy, radiotherapy, orchidis, human beta defense in abnormalities, granulomatous diseases such as sarcoidosis and leprosy, sickle cell disease, smoking and alcoholism, substance abuse, and excessive intake of caffeine. Post-testicular causes include congenital blockage of the duct system, cystic fibrosis, acquired blockage of the duct system due to infections, trauma, and stones. Presence of anti-sperm antibodies, ciliary defects in the outflow tract, ejaculatory duct obstruction, and ejaculation issues due to diabetic neuropathy, bladder neck surgery, retroperitoneal lymph node dissection, transurethral prostatectomy, colon or rectal surgery, multiple sclerosis, and spinal cord injury.